this anywhere else in the country, but Tatarstan is full of unique places. When you think of things associated with Russia, it's possible that high-quality timepieces might not make it onto your list. But it seems that the Swiss don't have this market totally sewn up, because just outside Kazan is an international watchmaker's, and it's Russian. Back in the Soviet Union, everyone wanted a Vostok, and this one, the Komandirsky, was a real classic. They called it the Kalashnikov of watches, because it was cheap, it was durable, and you could use it in any conditions. Vostok have been in business since 1942. They made their name supplying officers in the army, and they went on to produce watches that worked on submarines and in space. This factory is the only one of its kind in Russia, and one of only five in the world that puts together its watches from start to finish. Dmitry is the company's head designer, and he took me down to the factory floor to meet the team. They churn out more than 20,000 watches every month. This is the main operation for right. where we're fixing the bridges and the spring bar and the wheel. Mm -hmm. That's what we call the heart of the that watches. It's absolutely, of course, totally minuscule. And you can just see these tiny little details in there. So precise. It's an incredibly delicate operation. The ladies deal with dozens of tiny pieces that make up each watch's mechanism. And every one has to be accurately placed. You've got to have excellent eyesight if you want to work here. The watches are put through a whole series of different tests to check their durability, reliability and resistance to pressure. And if they pass, it's back to the factory to be boxed up and sold. So after countless pairs of hands and more than 200 different moving parts, your Vostok watch is ready. A little mechanical Russian classic. One thing about visiting a watch factory, you've got no excuse for not being on time for your next appointment. And this was one 